Fight Night on the Zone, brought to you by William Hill. What a journey for both of these men to make it to the tournament finals as we take a look at the bracket. Adams with wins over Villarreal and Verone Katsarakis with wins over Abdukakarov and Terry. The two pre-tournament favorites making good on those predictions and meeting in the finals as we take a look at the tail of the tape. You see the height advantage of Andreas Katsarakis. That's there, but it's identical in terms of reach. And you know that Katsarakis wants to make this an inside fight. Can Brandon the Cannon Adams hold off the underdog Katsarakis here in the finals? <laughs> Body work there from Adams. Good work back off the ropes. Flurries to the body, but Katsarakis smothering Adams right now. Wicked body shot there from Adams. Uh oh. 
Max is a warrior. Oh, no. Oh, good left button, but Katsarakis yes. comes right back. Take a look at the punch stats once more. 172 of 744 for Adams, 137 of 543 for Katsarakis. Brandon's doing an excellent job of staying off the ropes and being fast. The cat's just not taking his foot off the If I was forced to make a decision right now, who wins this fight? I'll lean towards Brandon Adams, but what a fight, guys. Closing moments oh, of an overtime boxing classic. Two men who respected each other before the fight, definitely after. Incredible fight tonight. To the winner, by way of split decision. And now, WB Silver Eliminator, WBA Continental Americas, and the OTX Super Welterweight Tournament Champion. From Athens, Greece. Adams, what can I say? Amazing fighter, gave me hell of a fight. I had to fight smart, I had to fight up close to keep his punches and his, uh, and his power short. Amazing, amazing. You know, on this, from the start of the fight, you were pushing your head into his chest and trying to keep him on the ropes. Yeah. Was that part of the game plan going into this fight? The game plan was to stay on his chest 10 rounds. And that's what we tried to do. Adams is a very craft fighter. He ducks with his head. If you don't do it, he will do it. And I think it's going to be harder to fight him this way. He's good moving forward. He's good moving backwards. But he's better moving forward and in the mid-distance. So that's what we worked on. That's what we applied. That's what we did.